Hello boys and girls, welcome to another raffle for Vinyl Countdown. This one is for the Raconteurs double set. Um, it's a little bit dark in here today, I've just lost the bulb and it's pissing down with rain outside. So hopefully you'll be able to see things clear enough, but apologies that it's slightly dark. Right, um, most of you have played in my raffles before, but there are one or two uh, new names to me, so uh, welcome. Um, because there's a couple of new names, I'm going to go through the way I do things. Um, all of you other guys are just going to have to sit and listen to it. Sorry, lads. Uh, bingo balls in the bingo ball cage. All 25 numbers are in there. Uh, they've already been pre-mixed. The reason they are pre-mixed is because this thing has a habit of spitting things out during the mix. If something is spat out during the mix, uh, that ball is considered drawn and we will continue with the raffle. Last ball out is our winner and that person will get the records shipped to their house. Pretty straightforward stuff. Right, who have we got? Runners and riders. Uh, 11 people playing over 30 spots. Mark, Anderson and Crispian have four apiece. Stephen, three. Mark Dixon, Philip, George, Keith, Sean and Shane all have two apiece. And we have two single hitters, if that's not a contradiction, uh, of Sam and Peter. Only takes one to win it. Righty ho, let's give him a mix on camera and see if anything does pop out. And look at that, they behave themselves, lovely jubbly. Right, uh, straight run through to the end now. There's no bonus prizes or secret prizes on this one. Uh, tend to do that in raffles that are over 40 spots. Uh, but this one, yeah, straight run through to the end and um, good luck to everybody. Off we go. First ball out, number two. Number two is Mr. Mark Anderson. Number 20 is also Mr. Mark Anderson. Not a great start for you, fella. I suppose it only matters what the last ball is. How you get there, kind of irrelevant. You've got to be joking. Number 24 is Mr. Mark Anderson. That is a triple straight off the bat for you, fella. That's about as brutal as it gets. Um, apologies for that. One spot left. Let's hope that one doesn't come out next. Otherwise, otherwise I don't know what I'll say, to be honest. I'll be stumped. Number four, Philip. At least it wasn't Mark. I did a raffle once where I pulled five out of the first six balls and they were all the same guy. And then he got eliminated very quickly afterwards. But three, the first three, it's a shame there's no price for that, eh, Mark? Because the odds of that are pretty slim. 19. George. Twenty-five. Stephen. Great name, Stephen. Strong, trustworthy name for Stephen. Like it. Number seven. Crispian, which I also like. That's a great name. I've always thought your um, your name, Crispian, um, I've no idea if it is or isn't, but I've always thought it sounded like a stage name. Number nine. What you'd be doing on stage, I have no idea. Mark, that was your uh, fourth of four. I am sorry we lost you so early, but you took a absolute beating at the beginning of this raffle, and um, you haven't survived much longer, I'm afraid. So sorry, thanks for playing, and really unlucky, really unlucky. Sorry, fella. The main reason I use the old bingo balls is to try and avoid doubles and trebles. But as we've just seen, you can't eliminate them. That is the rub of the raffle. That is Sam Hogg. Sam, mate, you only have the one, so I'm afraid we lose you. That particular dream, uh, Hail Mary as the Yanks call it, was over. Thanks for playing. Unlucky. Number 16. Sean Sinclair. Where are you hiding, Sean? There we are.
number six. Stephen. Down to your last ball, Stephen. My favourite number, number three. Today belongs to Crispian. That's two spots, Crispian. Number five is Mark. Ooh, that one tried to escape. Uh, number 15 was the unruly one. Uh, Sean Sinclair. Pretty sure I've said your name before, Sean. Yes, I have. Sorry, fella. That's uh, your second of two. So we lose you there. Uh, thanks for playing. Unlucky. Two little ducks. Number 22 is Shane. That's your first one, Shane. Number 21. Stephen. Oh, down to your... Oh, no, sorry, Stephen. I thought you had four spots. You don't. You have three. That was your third of three, Steve. Uh, thanks for playing. Unlucky. It's been a while since you won one of mine. Number 18. Shane. Sorry, Shane, that's your second of two, so we lose you there. Thanks for playing, unlucky. Number 14. Keith. That's your first one, Keith. Still got one left. Number one. Crispian, down to your last spot. In fact, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, six balls left, six people left, one spot each. Sudden death, six way shootout. Best of luck, guys. Every ball is an eliminating ball, though, now. We do not want to hear your name. Here we go. Number 11. Peter. Sorry, fella, that was your uh, one and only. So we lose you there. Thanks for playing, unlucky. Into the last five, twitchy bum time. Number 12, that's Mark. Sorry fella, thanks for playing, unlucky. Four left. Number 23, it's Keith. Unlucky fella, thanks for playing. Do, do, do. That's the last of my um, new people uh, for this raffle, so that means it's not going to be beginner's luck. One of the remaining three is going to be a regular. Good luck, guys. And if you are a regular, you'll know that when you get down to the last few balls on this contraption, it can take a while to get them in the cup. Number eight. Crispian, sorry fella, unlucky, thanks for playing. Down to Philip and George. Number 10. George, unlucky fella, thanks for playing. So unless something's gone horribly wrong. The last ball, which I'm going to help along because we'll be here till bloody Christmas, should be Phillips. Get in there. There you go. Last ball out is number 17. Nothing left in the contraption. That concludes our draw. Ball number 17. Do, do, do. Was indeed Mr. Philip Tinkler. Congratulations, Philip. Um, thanks for everyone for playing. Um, Philip, if you can get in contact with me and let me know where I'm shipping this to. Did you just win one off me recently? I think you may have done. I might have one that's due to go out to you today. 
I, I do so many of these that I actually forget. Let me check that. I might already have your details. Um, if not, you know what? Send me details anyway, just in case. All right. Um, but if I'll go and check now, and if um, if I do have them, I'll I'll ship this out today, um, straight away because I'm I'm going to the post office in literally an hour. Anyway, waffling on. Thanks everyone for playing. Congratulations to Phil. Uh, see you all in the next one. Cheers, Luke. Bye.